I'm Catherine. We're cooking with ABC 13 and my mother Charlotte here in the Goya kitchen. And today we are making jambalaya that is one pan jambalaya. My favorite. Anything it's in one pan really works for me. Less cleaning. I like it. I like it. So we're going to start off by browning some pre-cooked turkey sausage. So we'll get the olive oil going in the pan. So you got the oil heating up, we're gonna add in, you can use smoked turkey sausage or andouille sausage. Andouille is traditional for jambalaya, but if you wanna use something healthier, you can use low fat turkey sausage, whatever kind of pre-cooked sausage you like. So we'll let that brown up right here in our pan. So we're gonna turn down the heat just a touch and take that sausage out and put it aside. Thank you, mom. No problem. So our next step in our one pan wonder is to add the onions, the bell pepper, celery. This Goya minced garlic is great if you don't like having your oh, fingers smell, smell like it. garlic. I love that smell though. Just let that saute and sizzle up. We'll go ahead and put the tomatoes in too. Okay. These tomatoes are beautiful. They are. They're so pretty. Bright red. Bright red, yes. There's nothing like garlic and onion sauteing together. Here comes the pepper. Great. Great. And here comes the salt. And, and then the Goya Sazonador Total, which makes its way into a lot of my dishes at home. <laughs> <laughs> Mine too. Great all-purpose seasoning. You can add the vegetable broth in next. Here comes the broth. You can use chicken broth, you can use vegetable broth. Uh, the Goya Bouillon Powder is great. Just mix that with some water and it comes right together. Mm -hmm. Let's right. go ahead and add the rice, Mom. Here it comes. Thank you. Just make sure it's all incorporated. And then I'm gonna turn up the heat a little bit because we want to bring it to a boil. Okay. So we've got One our Goya paprika going right in for some extra flavor. So we've got it all in. We're gonna bring it up to a boil. As soon as it's bubbling, then we'll reduce it to a simmer and let it just do its thing for about 15 minutes or so. So in 15 minutes, we basically have jambalaya. All of that moisture is evaporated from it and we have this great consistency. And all we need to do now is put the sausage that we cooked earlier back into the pan. So good. It does. So you just mix this back in, cut the heat, and then you just cover your pot. Let it stand for a few minutes. I'd say 10 to 15, but you could probably do a little less time than that. Smells so good. Yummy. Nice. And so easy, one pan. Let's give it a try. You're safe. Mm. Oh, I like this. Virtually no cleanup. Mm -mm. Maybe one of the best parts. That's a one pot meal and done in 30 minutes. Mm -hmm.